Our topic this week is distracted by distractions. All right, so sometimes we have a lot of things going on. Uh, sometimes we have nice distractions, but other times we just have a whole bunch of stuff going on. And uh, it kind of takes us off uh, off focus, off track. Uh, like I said, just, you know, lots of things. Um, and so depending on your situation and, you know, just talking about, okay, as a, a college student, you know, online student, uh, you know, you have a primary focus of trying to get your schoolwork done and study but then you got all these other things that go on that kind of distract us sometimes so and uh, I pick on the media sometimes because they can be the biggest distraction and I'm not talking about you know um, you know serious incidents or something that happened but in in general um, you know the media some people are really consumed by the news media and social media and uh, you know and one of the problems is they believe what they see on social media and the news sometimes so that you know so being obsessed where you spend more time on that than you do on your other you know responsibilities um, you know so I, I me being older you know I, I remember when I was a kid watching you know the evening news back when there was only three channels and uh, so journalism used to be about reporting the news uh, today it's gotten more about inserting personal political views and slanted, per, you know, percep perceptives or perceptions about the news. Um, you know, let you know. Next time you watch a, one of the regular newscasts, listen to what the reporters are actually saying, and how much of it is actually stating a fact and actually inserting a whole bunch of side information in there. So, and my point is, you know, we we believe opinions to be true sometimes, depending on where we're getting it from. I use documentaries as an example. Uh, you know, a lot of the documentaries that are made recently are opinions instead of facts. Uh, they're based on personal opinions. And unfortunately, people believe uh, these documentaries are true. Uh, and this results in personal views being formed based on misinformation. And I use Michael Moore as, the ex as an example because uh, back when I got my MBA up in Michigan, uh, and I got it at the... Uh, you know, up at the University of Michigan in, in Flint, where I got it, and um, Michael Moore in Flint is like a, a dirty word, um, you know, based on his um, his documentary he did, which, um, according to people in Michigan, is not a documentary, and but it ruined the city of Flint, um, you know, with businesses, you know, not coming in. I mean, there's a whole lot of things in there, but so the the view up in uh, Flint, Michigan, is Roger Moore's documentary ruined the city because of a lot of false information in there, and but it was opinion. So again, that's that's my point. Um, distractors influence our mood. They influence our attitude, how we utilize our time, how we react to things. Uh, how we conduct ourselves and how we develop perspectives or views based on information that may or may not be true. So, uh, but it's just distracting time. So, uh, it's it's kind of ironic that uh, entertainment news like TMZ uh, has more uh, reliable news sometimes than the actual news. Uh, but anyway, my point of the story here is. Uh, distractors distract you from your purpose. Uh, you need to step back and evaluate your news from two sides. Don't let media and events distract you. Uh, you have a purpose. Uh, you, you know your schoolwork, family, work, quality of life, everything else that you have going on. Uh, those are your priorities. All right. So don't let the distractions uh, in life stop you from your dreams and your goals. Don't. Just don't let them do it, all right? Don't let media and events be in charge of your life. Be in charge of your own life, all right? So, you know, all these distractors, and whether it be fake news or not fake news or whatever different sides of the political coin say, um, try not to let it impact you and focus on yourself, all right? Stay focused, get rid of your distractions, and accomplish your goals.